are inside a home that's in dire need of a roof, and we're going to give that to a, a lucky viewer this morning. Uh, we'll have some of that coming up on Fox in the Morning. This afternoon. All right, looks like we might see some sunshine, and uh, the people in uh, Portland, where our crew is right now, are probably happy it's not raining this morning. That's right, because Keith Kaiser is helping put on a brand new roof for the winner of our Roof 809 contest. Keith, what's the story? Who are you helping out, and uh, who is Bison? What's Bison roofing up to right now? All right, well, we're helping Pat Simmon this morning here in Portland, a regular house. Regular uh, situation, but then when you look around, you can see the aftermath of a bad roof. I mean, this this room hasn't been really used in about a year now, and you look up at the ceiling, too, um, as the water has come in. Of course, the rain yesterday didn't help out at all. And, and Pat Simmon is with me this morning, and Pat, this has got to be exciting. Uh, roof 809, you're the recipient of that, and so uh, how, how did you get to this stage? What, what happened to the roof? Well, it had started to go bad approximately about maybe a year, year and a half ago. And it just continually got worse, mm -hmm. you know, with the weather and then the rainstorm, I mean, the uh, ice storm yep. and the windstorm and everything. It just added to the problem. So a year ago, you were still using this room. And then yes, it, exactly. every, all the rain coming in and, and all the, the what's going on here. And who, who nominated you for this? Well, I had originally seen an, uh, an advertisement for mm -hmm. it on the news. Mm -hmm. And so I mentioned it to my daughter half kiddingly, jokingly around, <laughs> and unbeknownst to me, she went behind, you know, went on herself and got onto the website, and she's the one that nominated me, and I had no idea. There you go. Oh, Tiffany, come in here. We'll just get a, a picture of Tiffany wave out there, <laughs> and so she, she really cares about her mom and wants this to be great, and then we have uh, Adam Coughlin with uh, Bison Roofing going to make all this happen, so what, what's on tap today, Adam? Uh, well, obviously, we have some roof problems here, so what we're going to do yep. is tear the old roof off, replace any wood that needs to be replaced, and we're going to put a nice 40-year shingle on, take care of some ice and water shield and all the details, and really make sure this thing's never going to leak again. Gonna be, it's going to be nice. Roof aid uh, 09, we're going to make sure Pat's all taken care of here. Adam's going to take care of that, too, with bison roofing, so uh, stay with us as we rip this uh, roof off and put our brand new one on, all right? You're not going to be up here with the shingle guys, are you? Well, yes, I am. Are you really? Well, yeah. Oh, I'm going to get on the roof and see what's going on. Well, make sure okay. you get your sticky shoes. Get those sticky shoes right. on. A soda machine. I believe that. His dog has made it back. Well, that's great. Summer's a good time to get out on the water and fish, but a father-son duo is taking that to a new level. Their ambitious fishing idea and how you can track their progress. Plus... It's Roof 809, and deserving viewer is getting a new roof by uh, Bison Roofing. And here's just some of the aftermath of what's been going on the past year. We'll show you some more of that coming up on Fox in the Morning. We had a contest going a couple weeks ago called Roof Aid 09. We wanted to give a viewer a new roof, but not just anybody, somebody who really needs one and can't afford to get it put on there. We have selected our deserving roof recipient, and Roof Aid 09 is taking place right this very minute in the Portland area of Northwest Louisville. Keith Kaiser's there. Hey, Keith. Hey, uh, I think we're going to have a Roof Aid 09 song. I think we had to work one up. Pat, you're in charge of writing that song. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> but Pat Simmons, you're deserving with a brand new roof here from Bison Roofing. Um, I mean, and it's been trouble because the catch-22 is you can't get homeowner's insurance because, because of the roof. Of so exactly. what, what's that all about? Well, when I would have tried to apply for insurance, they'd come to do the inspection, which is, you know, normal. Mm -hmm. The roof would always be the downfall. Mm -hmm. So I couldn't get the homeowners because of the roof. It just I keeps couldn't going. get the roof fixed because during all the storms because I had no homeowners. Mm -hmm. So it was just like a catch-22. It you know? It's just a, a circle that you couldn't get out of. And exactly. so let, let's put up some, uh, some video that we shot earlier of the roof. Of course, when the sun pops up, we'll be on the roof with bison roofing. And, and we'll rip this baby off, see what's underneath, and then start to make the repairs. What do you expect up here, Adam, when you, when you get on the roof? Well, there's probably going to be some rotted wood. L looking at all this, mm -hmm. I mean, clearly water is getting inside, so that's definitely going to be an issue. So we want to make sure the wood is good and sturdy, you know, so that we can really have a good foundation for the roofing shingles to go on. So Pat's talking about homeowner's insurance, and uh, you were, you've been on the, the insurance side of it. Yes, sir. And then making adjustments and then uh, helping out homeowners. So what have you seen in your experience? You know, I've, I've seen a lot of cases in this town where uh, a, a lot of folks, you know, maybe didn't get a fair